Hello guys and welcome back to our channel Rescue Digital Media. Today, in this video, I will show you how to fix GOM player error 0 by 0000059 with 6 quick fixes. But before that, like, subscribe and ring the bell icon to get notified when our new video lands. Runtime code 0 by 0000059 happens when GOM player fails or crashes whilst it's running. It doesn't necessarily mean that the code was corrupt in some way, but just that it did not work during its runtime. GOM player runtime error 0 by 0000059 occurs due to conflicting background programs, low memory, outdated graphics driver, or virus infection. Now, let's move on to fix this issue. Solution 1. Close conflicting programs. When you get a runtime error, keep in mind that it is happening due to programs that are conflicting with each other. So, close them all to fix the error. Here what you need to do. Open Task Manager by pressing Ctrl Alt Del button at the same time. Go to the Processes tab. Now, highlight each program that might causing the error and tap the End Process button. Solution 2. Update your drivers. Make sure that your video and audio drivers are up to date. Outdated drivers can cause conflicts and result in runtime errors. Here is how you can do so. Open Run menu by pressing Win plus R keys altogether. Next, on the Run dialog box, type devmgm.msc and hit Enter. Now on the Device Manager, expand the Display Adapters section by double-clicking on it and select the Graphics Driver from the list. Right-click on the driver and tap Update Driver option. After that, wait for the Windows to download the updated drivers. Once downloaded, follow the on-screen instructions to install the update. Lastly, Reboot your PC and verify if the error still persists on GOM player or not. Solution 3. Disable Data Execution Prevention DEP. DEP can sometimes cause conflicts and result in runtime errors. So, try disabling it on your PC. To do so, follow these steps. Right-click on the Start Menu button and type Control Panel on Search Box. Launch Control Panel and select System and Security. Now, go to System and choose Advanced System Settings on the left side of the window. Click on the Settings button under the Performance section. Click on the Data Execution Prevention tab. Select Turn on Depth for all programs and services except those I select. Click on the Add button and browse to the executable file of the program you want to exclude from DEP. Select the file and click Open. Click Apply and then OK to save the changes. Solution 4. Run Disk Cleanup You might also be experiencing runtime error because of a very low free space on your computer. Here are the steps to follow. Click on the Start Menu button and search for Disk Cleanup. Click on Disk Cleanup from the search results. Select the drive that you want to clean up, usually the C, Drive, and click OK. Disk Cleanup will scan your system for unnecessary files that can be safely deleted. Once the scan is complete, select the checkboxes next to the types of files you want to delete, E, G, Temporary Files, Recycle Bin, etc. Click OK to confirm the deletion of the selected files. A message will appear asking if you want to permanently delete the selected files. Click on the Delete Files button to proceed. Wait for Disk Cleanup to finish deleting the selected files. Solution 5. Reinstall GOM Player Uninstall GOM Player from your computer and then reinstall it from the official website. This can help resolve any corrupt files that may be causing the issue. Here are the steps to follow. On your Windows desktop, press Windows plus R keys together to open a run box. Next, 
type of quiz.cpl there and hit enter. Now, search and find the GOM player app then right click on it. Select the uninstall. After this, go to the GOM player's official website and download its latest version. When complete, simply run the executable file and follow your on-screen instructions in order to complete the process. Finally, launch the GOM player and check if the error disappeared. Video Repair Tool To fix the video-related issues, we recommend you use Video Repair Tool. It is a professionally recommended utility that can fix all sorts of video-related issues like choppy, jerky, grainy, pixelated, out of sync, etc. Here are steps to use the software. Step 1. Download, install and launch video repair software on your system. Click on Add Files to add corrupted video files. Step 2. Click on Repair button to begin the repairing process. This start repairing your added video files one by one. Step 3. You can click on Preview, in order to preview the repaired video file within the software. And click on Save Repaired Files button to save the repaired videos at desired location. Find its download and user guide links in the below description box.